Now we're working new details on Rhode Island's most notorious serial killer. Craig Price was 15 years old when he confessed to murdering four neighbors. 22 years later, he's asking to return to Rhode Island to argue his latest appeal. From the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly is live in the capital city. One of Rhode Island's most notorious serial killers once again is fighting for his freedom, but prosecutors are fighting back. But Craig Price... Dangerous, evil. Patrick Youngs would know he's been prosecuting Craig Price ever since the teenager admitted to murdering four of his neighbors in Warwick in 1987 and 89. Back then, state law didn't allow juveniles to be tried as adults, so Craig Price would have been set free when he turned 21. But he's still locked up because a judge gave him a 25-year sentence for criminal contempt after he refused to obey a court order to undergo psychological testing. Now, in a handwritten appeal, Craig Price is asking the state Supreme Court to end his sentence, which he called unduly harsh and unconstitutional. Patrick Youngs argues the serial killer is right where he belongs, behind bars. Craig Price will never go away from us for at least a generation, because that's, that's unthinkable that a 13-year-old, 13-year-old boy can do that. When my, thir- when my son was 13, he was playing Little League. Craig Price was 13, he was murdering his neighbor. When he's 15, he's butchering little girls. We will never recover from that as a community and as a society. And Craig Price will always be part of Rhode Island. The picture of evil for Rhode Island? Well, unfortunately, Rhode Island's had a number of pictures of evil, um, but he's certainly, certainly one of them. Craig Price is now 37. The Supreme Court is set to hear arguments in his appeal March 2nd. Live at the Supreme Court with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.